Ladies and gents, backstage here at the last night of Carl Cox's The Revolution here in London, and I'm sitting backstage with Nick Fanciulli. How are you? I'm good, thanks. Yeah, it was amazing out there. Oh, mate, that was epic. Did you yeah, enjoy it? Yeah, it was good. Apart from the little sound drop out in the middle. Part. <laughs> what sound drop out? I didn't hear anything. I don't know. I think, <laughs> I think someone fell on the mixing desk out the back. So, yeah. <laughs> That's no, wrong. No. So it's your first time playing at Electric, yeah? Yeah, yeah. It was um, Actually, I was talking to my mum about this. She used to come here in the 70s when it was the fridge, so... <laughs> She was like, you know, you always, you know, she was telling me how it was a great place back then, and then, and obviously they've renovated it now, and it's, yeah. it's, it's cool. It's really definitely cool. put Brixton on the map in a big way. Yeah, no, it's, uh, it was especially with Carl's done three sort of sellout shows in a row, which is, you know, unheard of in the sort of underground circles. So yeah, it's pretty impressive. Yeah. Now, Nick, you're you're risen with the revolution, obviously playing at the space parties in Ibiza, and those must be fun for you. Yeah, it was great. You know, I, I was um, I was resident of space anyway, and then I left the night that I was at, and I went and did uh, one one party. I think it was in 2009 for Carl. Yeah. And he never had a regular resident. You know, he always had like special guests and. And then I think in 2010 we got asked to do sort of five shows for him. It was the first time that they started having residents. And, you know, the, the great thing about him, he's like one of the most sort of nicest, most humbling sort of people I've, I've worked with. And, and, and to sort of spend the summer working with them guys is, you know, sort of like a special thing. So, yeah, yeah, it is indeed. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we found ourselves really grateful to be working with Carl Cox and yourselves and the whole of Safe House crew as well. So what was it like playing for the Revolution in London? Must have been a nice change? Yeah, you know, we, we did one actually, I think, t a few years ago in, a, in Camden, but this one beats it, totally yeah. beats it. You know, it was the people, as soon as, they, as soon as I got on the decks, they were just uh, up for it. You know, and, and it's quite hard to control, sort of hold it back. Because obviously, you know, obviously it's, it's Carl's night and you want him to sort of get the benefits of tonight. But, you know, it was it was good. It's a really good stage as well, the whole lighting setup and everything as well. Yeah, and the sound as well. The sound was, was really good. And it's it's always harder than sort of, because it's, it's a theatre, isn't it, basically? It feels yeah. like a theatre. So, you know, to get the sound right is is, is, is a tough thing when it was it was rocking tonight. Yeah, awesome. so, now, Nick, yeah. you've got a new tune coming out. Do you want to tell us about that? It's actually um, a compilation for a balance. It's an Australian company that, uh, that I've been working with for about six months and it's a double CD that comes out on May the 7th and it's um, the first CD is basically a, a showcase of music that I've been playing over the last few years and the second CD is a, a showcase of my label Saved. So yeah, it was it, it was a tough project, but um, I'm glad that it's done and it's going to be out soon. It's pretty massive, more yeah. than more than just a track. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was. Uh, yeah, I think it was. Um, the stress levels were high on that one, but I'm, I'm just glad it's done. I hope people really like it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, uh, you're one of the very few people that caught my accent off the key just like that, and we were actually back st on stage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I can. Yeah, no, it's only because my, my 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 wife's from um, South Africa as well, so yeah. it's uh, it's quite an easy tone to pick up. <laughs> uh, have we gotten you to play out there yet? Yeah, I've played out there actually. I, I played there early on, sort of like the Millennium, um, 2001, 2002. But I haven't actually played there since 2002, which is strange. So yeah, I, I go back quite regularly, but yeah. yeah. Normally, I think because it's one of the places I look at as a holiday, so I, you know, I never really get, I never really think about playing there. Don't spend too much time with me because we might actually start booking you there. Yeah. You won't have a holiday in Cape Town anymore. <laughs> no, I'd love actually to go back and try it. So. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Cool. And Nick, what else is coming up for you? I mean, we've obviously got an amazing summer coming up in Ibiza. Um, your residency sticking through with Carl and the Revolution. What can we expect from you this summer? We've got um, a lot of sort of European dates because we normally still stay local. And yep. we've got a lot. We do this thing at a safe party, actually, which mm -hmm. is my label. We did it in my hometown of Maidstone. And uh, it's something really special for me. You know, we've got our first one. Um, tomorrow we have a uh, Jamie Jones and Damien Lazarus playing and the next one we have a uh, Luciano playing and it's, it's crazy because it's a small little town in the middle of the countryside and and you know we have like a thousand kids turn up and and it's just rocking That's yeah I'll be hearing about that a couple of weeks uh, sorry it was last year you were yeah, doing it. yeah. Was, uh, and Carl's actually played there and he, he was yeah. like yeah it's the best small place I've played so and what like 12 pound tickets or something yeah it's yeah. really really reasonable <laughs> and it's just saying you know we give something back to sort of the, the people that sort of help me make my career because I started my residency in Maidstone and you know I've, I've got a lot of respect for the people that sort of helped me and, and pushed me through so it's my sort of giving something back and you know we've had everyone you know we've, we've actually got obviously Luciano on the next one then Loka Dice and then uh, Joris Vaughan so yeah that's a lineup, eh? Yeah, that's great. <laughs> Doing well, yeah, awesome. Yeah, yeah. Well, Nick, listen, I know we want to go out and party to Carl Cox <laughs> playing the last set of three nights in a row. Yeah. So, um, last question for you, being on Lucky Live TV. Yeah. Nick, what's the luckiest thing that's ever happened to you? <sighs> I think my son. 
having yeah. my son there two years ago, yeah. Awesome. So, yeah. Very cool, guys. Yeah. Wicked. Well, that's myself here, Mike Perry, on Lucky Live TV at Carl Cox's The Revolution in London, catching up with resident DJ Nick Venturi. Thank you Thanks, very much. mate. Thank Cheers. You.